Hello everyone, this is Steve Klotz with Youth, Youth Runner Magazine here in Tampere, Finland. I'm with Otto Bolden and Brianna Williams. Otto, um, I understand you're coaching Brianna. Can you tell us uh, how that's gone for you? Um, it's gone well for me. <laughs> um, I have known Brianna since she was a lot younger, um, but at the time, I was not interested in coaching. Um, I then started to coach uh, Khalifa St. Fort from Trinidad and Tobago. And then uh, Brianna kind of said, hey, you know, remember me? So the two of them have become training partners and uh, they've done very well. They've both broken their uh, respective national youth records. Khalifa also has the national junior record of Trinidad and Tobago. She is two hundredths away. So um, we're hoping to leave here with, with all the records. Now. Wow, that's awesome. And do you have any future plans, uh, Brianna, with your coach, Otto? Oh, yes, you know, to go a long way, for, uh, especially going pro division and making it to the Olympics. Oh, um, going pro and making it to the Olympics. You're going to go to the Olympics? Yeah. That would be awesome. So the reason why the Olympics is not even a thing for her is because her training partner, Khalifa St. Ford, went to the Olympic Games at 18 as a high school senior two years ago for Trinidad and Tobago and then anchored the, the, the 4 by one in the final. So because she trains next to somebody who has already been an Olympic finalist as a teen, it's not, it's not even a big deal. It's not even a big step for her. She's like, well, I train next to Khalifa. We do the same things. We almost run the same time. So, you know, in another year or two, I'll be there. Um, I have no doubt in my mind that she's going to make the, the Jamaican Olympic team. This year, she was fifth at the Jamaican Senior Championships. So she would place. run so she for would have, Jamaica, right? She would be going on the relay regardless Yeah. this year. Yeah. And she has two more years. So um, as long as, you know, as long as I continue to, to do right by her, I think, and she, um, and she stays injury-free, I would bet a lot of money that she's going to be on that Jamaican Olympic team in two years. Well, thank you very much for this interview. And Thank good you. luck to you, Brianna and Otto. Good luck to you with your coaching career. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.